Once your first LEGO League team has identified a problem to solve and designed an innovative solution based on your research, it is time to share with others. Who do you want to share your work with? Sharing with anyone will meet the basic sharing requirement. You can choose to present what you learn to other students or teachers at your school, your parents and guardians, or your local government. Even though you can share with anyone you want, we encourage you to think about who could benefit from your solution. As a team, think about who your solution would help. Do you know any of those people? Could your solution help the professional you learned about or interviewed during your project research? Can you find a way to share your solution with that person? Design your presentation. Now that you know who you want to share with, think about how to share your problem and solution. Think about the talents of your team members. You've probably used posters or displays to present a school project in the past. That is one option for your first LEGO League project presentation. Or you can perform a skit. Some teams use the format of a commercial, a news broadcast, or a game show. This skit could be your whole presentation or just one part. Or you can use a computer slideshow, website, or video to tell part of your team's story. Or use a combination of presentation ideas. Just keep in mind that some of your presentation must be presented live. In fact, sometimes technology can fail. If you choose to use computers or other devices in your presentation, make sure you're prepared to present without them if anything goes wrong. Have fun with your presentation, but also make sure you cover all the important information. The purpose of your presentation is to teach others about the great work you did this season. Present your project at first LEGO League tournament. After you share your project with your community, prepare to share with the judges at a tournament. Read any information sent by your tournament director. They may let you know where your project judging session will happen and whether any equipment will be available. You will have five minutes to set up and present all of your information to the judges. Five minutes is not a lot of time, so make sure you practice both the setup and your presentation before the tournament. As you plan your project presentation, check the project updates and project rubric. The updates will tell you any new information or clarification about the project requirements. The project rubric will tell you exactly what the judges will look for in your presentation. Look carefully at the different levels of achievement to understand what information you should include. Do not expect to be at the highest level in every category your first year. At a minimum, make sure you tell the judges about the three essential project components, your problem, your solution, and how you shared. Remember, just like your project solution, your presentation must be the work of team members. Your coach may be able to watch the judging session, but only team members may present to the judges, even in a video. After you present to the judges, they will have a few minutes to ask your team questions. The judges may ask questions to any team member, so make sure each person knows at least a little about your team's project. Don't be nervous. You're the experts on your team's project. You designed it after all. The judges and other teams are really nice. Show them all the great work you did and enjoy hearing their feedback. They'll probably learn something new from your presentation. And you can learn something from them too. Visit www.firstlegoleague.org for more resources to help you with your project. The website also provides contact links for each First Lego League region in case you have further questions.